My name is Matt Swain. Uh, this is my wife, Emily Swain, and uh, we live here in the friendly city of Fairmont, West Virginia. We are a family of four. We have two great children. We have a six-year-old little boy. We have an almost one-year-old little girl named Bailey. So we realize that we really need somewhere that we can all fit and be together and be comfortable. And so we looked at a couple different builders, um, just just didn't have the right feel. Uh, when you know her coworker mentioned vision, we're like, hey, well, you know, we'll go give it give it a shot. We came to them with a tall order. Uh, my mom was moving to Fairmont, she had retired, she wanted to be near her grandchildren, and we knew that although we love each other very much, we needed our own space. <laughs> so it was really a situation where we were asking them what we thought was nearly impossible. We needed space for everyone. We wanted two living spaces that were joined, but barely. And Dave uh, sat down with us and he really went over and over with his pencil and his tape and his, and white his whiteout. And he went over every detail for this. So we were able to create something. We combined several house plans that they had and he was able to create something that was incredibly unique. So we were about a month, probably a few weeks, a month away from finishing the house. We got the news that our daughter was diagnosed with retinoblastoma, which is a rare uh, childhood cancer of the eye. Almost immediately, we called the folks at Vision and told them about Bailey and that we had to go to Cleveland Clinic the next week and she was gonna have to have surgery, she was gonna have her eye removed. We didn't know what our future was going to look like, uh, but one thing that we knew was that we wanted to be able to bring our daughter home um, to our new house. I came in on a Saturday morning and uh, Matt had asked me to call him because he had something to talk to me about. And he told me that his daughter Bailey had cancer and was going to have to have surgery and they needed to get into the house as quickly as they could. I had just assured them that we would do everything we could and um, I'd emailed Guy and told Guy that what the situation was and that if I needed to be there night or day I would do whatever and we all pitched in and we were going to do whatever it took to get that house done but Guy was able to pull it off. He called all of our crews together and got everything done so they could be in their house. Guy and Twyla and Rocky and Dave, they pulled all of their people and they worked so hard to get this house completed and when we came back we were in our new home. We got to bring her. It was one of the, it was the hardest thing that we've ever done our forever and our future is in this home and it means more than what we could possibly ever say to know that everyone there at Vision played a hand in that. They stepped in and they were there. They were the people that came and if that's not a family then I don't know what is. Words cannot describe the feeling that we have uh, towards Vision Home. Not just because of the quality of the house, not just because of the quality of their work, um, but that you can't uh, you can't describe that, and and that's something that is uh, that will forever be in our hearts and minds, and you know Absolutely. we will be, forever be grateful to them. Yeah.